A very good morning to all of you. Today we are going to discuss about the uncleanliness of public toilets. Disgusting. That phrase is often heard when it comes to the public toilets in Malaysia. Sometimes the users might want to think twice before using the public toilets in Malaysia. Malaysian public toilets certainly do not have a good reputation. The question is, what is the reason for this uncleanliness of public toilets in Malaysia? Well, I think that the unstable water pressure contributes to the uncleanliness of public toilets in Malaysia. First of all, there are times though when users cannot be fault, faulted for not flushing. The water pressure may be too low or the water tank doesn't have enough water. Let's say, in case of emergency, a person uses the toilet and tries to flush it. Suddenly, the water does not come because of low water pressure. Isn't, is it their fault? Um, in this kind of situation, uh, most of the people just leave the place like that because they cannot think about an alternative to solve this problem. So, the other person who want to use this toilet uh, will feel uncomfortable when seeing the condition of the toilet and just leave uh, the toilet and go to another toilet. Uh, this will lead the toilet to look filthy. So, here, the main problem is, uh, the main problem for all of these small problems is the unstable water pressure. In a nutshell, I can strongly say that the uncleanliness of public toilets is caused by the unstable water pressure. So, Nur Ayn Natasha, what do you think about this uncleanliness of public toilets? Okay, thank you Anishri. I do agree on, on your point, which is unstable water pressure is also contribute to, is contribute to un to the uncleanliness of the public toilet. Also, in my opinion, poor toilet facilities is also contribute to the uncleanliness of, of the public toilet. For example, if there are some toilet that may have dysfunction toilet flush, the excrement cannot be flushed away. So this problem will lead to um, producing an unpleasant odor that come from the excrement. People will also feel disgust or maybe feel reluctant to use or even enter the toilet. Um, apart from that, some toilet that may have leaking pipes also affect the, clean, un, the cleanliness of the toilet. The water that overflows from the leaking pipe uh, will cause the stagnant water in the toilet. Uh, the floor, even the floor of the toilet will getting slippery and the slippery toilet will be very dangerous to the elders and children to use it. If the, also if the toilet be, uh, left in that condition for too long and not get it clean, uh, the toilet will left uh, the presence of mucus. Therefore, this will make the toilet lose more filthy or dirtier uh, and it will become even harder to clean it. As to conclude my explanation, it is clear that poor toilet facilities is um, become huge impact on the uncleanliness of the public toilets. That's all for me. Thank you. Thank you, Nur, Nur Natasha. Uh, I can agree with your point. Sometimes the plumbing systems of the Public toilets are not really good. Okay, now, yeah. Putri Aisha, can I hear from you? Um, well, in my opinion, since we're talking about uncleanliness of public toilets, one who uses it, uh, uses it is definitely people, right? And I think one of the major factors that contribute to uncleanliness of public toilets is um, irresponsible users. 
these users, irresponsible users, sometimes they don't flush. And when this happens, it leaves behind, well, a disgusting order for the next person to use it, making them feel very discomfortable. And then people also step onto the toilet seats. And for example, if all of the cubicles are all in use, then one, one is left. But when you step into the cubicle, it turns out that the toilet seat is full of dirty footprints. It leaves a quite annoying feeling towards the user. So it, it disturbs people. Then, um, people don't use trash bin. I don't, I don't know why, but people still throw toilet paper into the toilet bowl, making it clog, making it um, leak. And then the cleaning lady would have to clean up after them, which is um, troublesome to the cleaning lady. So we don't want that. And then um, another prominent factor would be vandalism. Some of the writings are about people's feelings or vulgar remarks that leaves a very bad impression on people who use it. For example, tourists who come to Malaysia to use the public toilets. So I think that the major um, contribution to uncleanliness of public toilets is mostly because of irresponsible users. That's all for me. Thank you, Putri Aisha. I can agree with your point. The thing is, even if the plumbing systems are not good, the people have to take the pail and filling the water and and then uses it to flush the thing. You know, uh, although the facilities of the plumbing uh, facilities of the public toilets are not really good, they have to report it to the authority. So I think the most prominent a uh, factor of the uncleanliness of public toilet is the irresponsibility people. Uh, that's yes, all from I us. Agree. Yeah, I, I agree with it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.